Some found it odd that Kate Middleton didn't immediately share her health issues in early 2024. But it's a royal tradition to handle medical matters privately. Kate eventually revealed undergoing abdominal surgery and being diagnosed with cancer. Royals, like everyone else, aren't immune to health problems, despite access to top medical care. Kate expressed solidarity with cancer sufferers, urging them not to lose hope. Keep reading for 15 royal family health scares over the years. 1. Kate Middleton experienced a hospitalization during her pregnancy. The Princess of Wales faced severe morning sickness, known as hypermesis gravidarum, throughout all three of her pregnancies. Her struggle with this condition began during her pregnancy with Prince George, leading to hospitalization due to its severity. 2. Kate disclosed that she had been diagnosed with cancer. In January 2024, royal fans became worried upon hearing that the princess was undergoing abdominal surgery. Kate later disclosed that cancer was detected during the procedure, and she subsequently began treatment. The specific type and stage of cancer are undisclosed, but everyone is hopeful for her swift recovery. 3. King Charles has also received a cancer diagnosis. In 2024, Kate wasn't the only member of the royal family facing cancer. King Charles revealed in February that he had been diagnosed with the disease after what he assumed would be a routine prostate treatment. Despite undergoing treatment, he has endeavored to continue working as much as possible. However, there was a noticeable gap in the royal family's presence at events due to both him and Kate's absence. 4. Queen Elizabeth's Secret Bone Marrow Cancer It's not uncommon for members of the royal family to prefer to keep their health matters private. Even before Kate Middleton's delay in discussing her health, there were reports that Queen Elizabeth kept her bone marrow cancer diagnosis a secret until her passing. According to the New York Post, this revelation came to light in the biography Elizabeth, an Intimate Portrait, after the monarch's death. 5. The Queen Mother had two different types of cancer. Cancer has affected numerous members of the royal family. According to the Daily Mail, the Queen's mother faced colon cancer in the 1960s, followed by breast cancer in the 1980s. Although she underwent successful surgeries on both occasions, these health challenges only became public knowledge after the Queen Mother's passing in 2002. 6. The Queen's Mother Experienced a Near-Fatal Choking Incident The public became aware of a significant health scare when the Queen Mother was hospitalized in 1982 after choking on a fishbone which made headlines. According to Express, she underwent surgery to remove the obstruction and remained hospitalized for four days. 7. Princess Margaret experienced multiple strokes. The Queen didn't face significant health problems until later in life. But her sister, Princess Margaret, was often in the spotlight for her various health challenges. Margaret, known for her smoking habit, underwent a lung resection in 1985. Starting in 1998, she suffered from recurrent strokes, ultimately leading to her passing in 2002 at the age of 71, as reported by Today. 8. Prince Philip experienced heart issues. In the final decade of his life, Prince Philip faced numerous hospitalizations due to various heart-related issues, 
as reported by Business Insider. Notably, he was recuperating from a heart procedure he underwent in March 2021 when he passed away a month later in April 2021 at the age of 99. 9. Princess Diana fell down the stairs while pregnant. According to USA Today, Princess Diana's fall down the stairs at Sandringham in 1982 was initially reported as an accident. However, Newsweek later reported in the book, Diana, Her True Story, that she revealed the fall was deliberate. Diana stated, Charles said I was crying wolf and I said I felt so desperate. So I threw myself down the stairs. The queen comes out, absolutely horrified, shaking. She was so frightened. Thankfully, both Diana and the then-unborn Prince William were unharmed. 10. Diana faced challenges with her mental health. The incident involving the stairs was just one of Diana's cries for help during her marriage to Charles. Additionally, She grappled with bulimia during her early days in the royal family. Speaking openly about such issues was unprecedented at the time. However, Diana broke the silence and became one of the first royals to shed light on mental health issues. 11. Meghan Markle experienced a mental health crisis. Decades after Diana's era, Meghan Markle faced her own mental health crisis within the royal family. The Duchess of Sussex encountered significant external pressure and scrutiny after her marriage to Prince Harry, which became overwhelming for her during her pregnancy with Archie. In a 2021 interview with Oprah Winfrey, Meghan revealed, I just didn't want to be alive anymore. Although Meghan kept this struggle private from the public for years, she was able to confide in Harry at the time. Together, they worked through the challenges to support Meghan in reaching a better place mentally. 12. Princess Eugenie Required Scoliosis Surgery As a child, Princess Eugenie underwent significant corrective surgery to address her scoliosis. She shared details of the procedure with the Royal National Orthopedic Hospital charity, describing it as quite daunting. The surgery lasted eight hours, during which titanium rods and screws were inserted along her spine. This was, of course, a scary prospect for a 12-year-old. I can still vividly remember how nervous I felt in the days and weeks before the operation, she recalled. Years later, Princess Eugenie proudly displayed her surgery scar in her backless wedding dress. 13. Sarah Ferguson Experienced a Breast Cancer Scare Sarah, Duchess of York, faced her first encounter with cancer in 2023 when a routine mammogram revealed early-stage breast cancer. She underwent surgery to remove it and became a vocal advocate for preventive women's health care, emphasizing the importance of early detection in managing the disease. 14. Sarah, Duchess of York, was later diagnosed with skin cancer. Unfortunately, after dealing with breast cancer, Sarah Ferguson received another cancer diagnosis in early 2024, this time with skin cancer. She shared the news on Instagram in January, expressing her gratitude for the outpouring of love and support while maintaining a positive outlook despite the shock of the diagnosis. 15. Prince William and Charles were both affected by the global health crisis in 2020. In the early stages of the 2020 global health crisis, NPR reported that Prince Charles had tested positive for COVID-19. 
Given the novelty of the disease at the time, it was a concerning diagnosis. Thankfully, he recovered well. Later, Prince William disclosed to BBC that he had also contracted the virus around the same time as his father, but both eventually recovered. <laughs> 